Ninja Delta Talk Show. Head personalities in and around the Ninja Delta to tell their stories of how they've been able to surmount challenges and excel in their various ways of it. Uh, I'm a pastor by covenant. Uh, I'm a food man by calling. <laughs> okay. <laughs> One love, Niger Delta. It's not a democracy, that's another issue. It's not well, a democracy. What we have is not close to democracy. What do we have then? What we have is a caricature, labeled democracy. <laughs> What would be the fulcrum of your political trust on the assumption of office as a governor of Rivers? Major, John Croatia. Mm -hmm. Investing together. He said, I mean, nobody has won. Investing has won. I say to you that it's your Ninja Delta and my Ninja Delta, and together we'll build the Ninja Delta of our dreams. <laughs> Hello there, good to have you join us this beautiful evening on the Ninja Delta talk show with IB. Now quickly on the show, this week our sheep birthed at the sheep house and that is the home of the Pobeni family. Now this time it is a celebration of Nigerians most committed philanthropist, a celebrated retired naval chief who spent over 36 years navigating the seas in defense of his fatherland. Now it was a celebration galore as he turns 70. Indeed, families and friends rolled out drums to celebrate Festus Pobeni as he enters the biblical three scores and ten in sound health and sound mind. So you know what? Sit back as we take you through the activities marking FBI Pobeni's 70th birthday celebration here in the metropolitan city of Port Harcourt. So you know what? Don't go nowhere because we'll be right back after the break. birthday bash of His Excellency Admiral FBI Pobeni was heralded by a football match. Pobeni, a lover of sports for total fitness, was escorted to the field of Portacot Club 1928 by his adorable and amiable wife and close associates. After exchanging pleasantries, His Excellency Pobeni took the ceremonial kickoff to enable the two team lock horns in the Pobeni ceremonial match in commemoration of his 70th birthday. Hello, hello, hello. Got your wings, got your wings. The two captains. Hey. Thank <laughs> you. 
Shortly after the match, there was refreshment for guests, spectators and the players. This was immediately followed by the award ceremony. It is customary to give prizes to the winning team in this regard. Pobeni in his avalanche of magnanimity doled out 120,000 for the winning team while the other went home with 80,000 naira. Thank you all of you. And you see that the good players are those who know very well. Cassidy is a social son. And of course, she sees also somebody I know very well. And of course, that's my buddy, Kalika's son. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> and uh, to choose out of the three of them, I believe I just choose three as best players. <laughs> football you know, even though uh, there was a little bit of, of bias but that's to be expected <laughs> so thank, thank everybody for coming and we look forward to celebrating many more milestones i hope to see you soon thank you of the ceremony was the actual celebration for the septuagenarian shortly after his arrival with his family associates and cronies there was a special rendition by the fbi choir <laughs> To thrill the audience was a cultural performance by a very special group. This was followed by special performance by the FBI Marshals, an NGO known as Admiral Pobeni's Heroes Initiative, promoted by the celebrants, thrilled the crowd. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
on the occasion of his 70th birthday, titled All Work Ever, Dark Work Never. It was William Shakespeare who said, The evil that men do live after them. The good is often interred with the bones. For retired Ray Adira Poveni, his good shall never be spread for posterity, as only few men on earth today possess his hearts of gold. The incredible philanthropist, Pogeli is involved in the education of several youth through his scholarship scheme, a pastime in luxurious in. Our generation and indeed future generations will learn from the secrets of this great son of the Niger Delta that your wealth are not reduced by giving, that you are not reduced by being humble, that God remembers you for remembering the less privileged. Today, as we celebrate this auspicious occasion of your 70th solely and rewarding years on earth, I join all the people of Goodwill and your pet NGO, the Admiral Poveni Heroes Initiative, to toast seven hearty chairs to a great man, a God-fearing father, a solid pillar for youths to lean on, a shoulder for the underprivileged to work on, a defender of the weak, an inestimable treasure, the best and most dependable friend and ally anyone can find in the world. The best daddy with a heart of gold. The admirable admiral. We pray the Almighty God to bless you with longevity and sound health and sound mind. May your milk of human kindness never dry. And may your ship of life never sink. Sail on the best sail of our time. We wish you the continued views of heaven and much favor in every little label in Jesus' precious name. Happy birthday, Daddy. Michael Jackson of the Pobeni dynasty thrilled the audience with a digital breakdown to spice up the occasion for his dad who turned 70 to the glory of God. I appreciate this young boy. It will go places, I tell you. I be going to Michael Jackson. The old school dance was to remind the celebrants the old good days of yesteryears. However, he decided to dance to current tunes with his children and wife. A 
a celebrated legal luminary, a former president of MBA, a very good friend to the celebrants, Mr. OCJ Okocha San, took the toast to open up a new vista for the 70th birthday of Admiral FBI Paul Benny. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.